You can now join Charlie Brown and the Peanuts gang as they search for the real meaning of Christmas. The Fort Wayne Youth Theater is putting on the film, putting the film on stage rather. Joining us today is the director of the production, Christopher Murphy. Christopher, good morning. Good morning. Thank Thanks you. for having me. Yes. So tell us a little bit about the production. Obviously, we're all used to the classic, mm -hmm. but how is this being adapted for the stage? Uh, you know, everything that you love about a Charlie Brown Christmas on TV, you're going to see live on stage at the Fort Wayne Youth Theater. Uh, some extra surprises, uh, both in terms of the script and just directorial uh, and acting choices that we've made. But if you love a Charlie Brown Christmas at home, you're really going to love coming and seeing it live on stage at the Fort Wayne Youth Theater. And this isn't the first time you guys have done this. What's going to be different if somebody saw it, say, last year? It's an all-new physical production, uh, new cast members. Uh, but, you know, to me, I think at Christmas time, people love theatrical comfort <laughs> food. You know, we, uh, the thing that I associate, and the reason that we brought it back, not just because uh, of popular demand, but uh, because I think it, uh, you associate Charlie Brown Christmas with gathering around the TV with your family, you know, and all watching it together. And I think in 2018, we don't always take the time to do that, to sit down with people and watch the same TV show and certainly not to put our mobile devices away and watch one thing but our hope is that by doing it live on stage in a theater you're gonna bring your family you're gonna bring your friends and you're gonna make all new Christmas Christmas memories in a whole new way with this production live on stage all right let's talk about the cast now you guys mm -hmm. start classes as early as three but we do what are the children on stage what uh, are our, our cast ranges from about 8 to 18 years old so some of Fort Wayne's finest young actors yeah. And what has been the most challenging part of getting this whole production ready? Oh, Lord. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm a youth theater director, so someday it's, it feels like herding cats around. <laughs> uh, but the audience will notice that we will, we will have a slick, polished production by the time that audience walks in the door, for sure. And I have to know, is there going to be a child playing Snoopy? Or are we going to see a real beagle on well, stage? Well, <laughs> you know, my dog Herbie auditioned for the role, uh, but uh, we, we went with an actual actor. Uh, it's actually the cast member that played Peppermint Patty last year oh. is playing Snoopy this year. Nice. Yeah. And other than this, you guys are also having visits with Santa? We are on uh, Saturday the 8th and the 15th. You can come uh, 10 o'clock in the morning, and we're doing a breakfast with Santa event, games, food, sing-along stories, photo ops with the, the big red man and Mrs. Claus. It's going to be a lot of fun, a, a great event for the whole family. And then you get to stay, and that includes uh, VIP tickets to the performance of Charlie Brown that goes right after that. And I'm just going to reiterate this. Uh, when are the productions? Uh, the performances we run from the 7th to the 16th of December. All right. And are productions this large normal for you guys? Oh yeah, uh, you know we do four main stage productions a year in addition to all of our touring and our classes and our camps and all of that stuff. Uh, we perform at a lot of different venues around town, but size-wise this is, is pretty norm for us. Uh, it's definitely maybe one of the most recognizable titles that I think we've, we've hit in a while and we're really excited to bring it back again this year. All right, Christopher, thank you for stopping by. Thank we look you. forward to it. You can see the performances at First Presbyterian Theater opening night is Friday. Friday to catch this interview again, find the story on Wayne.com.